pretty much excited about DevOps, SRE, building stuff and scaling stuff and keeping stuff operational all the time. So, so I have like a lot of diverse experience and different different tools, and I would also like to like the brief uh, demo or the brief things for today would be how you can try to optimize or automate your cost savings in any cloud platform that you use. So, uh, basically, we used generative AI and a Rag pipeline to kind of make this whole system automated and uh, we'll see the level of things, like the actual impact that we could scale after we deployed the solution and actual the manual cost optimization and the overhead that it actually takes for DevOps engineers to gain the similar kind of cost saving. So, yep. Also just recently I have been selected as a DevOps ambassador and I'm amongst the youngest persons to be selected, so yeah. Thank you, thank you everyone. And I have built a lot of Gen AI apps, so so uh, I have few things that I could recommend, or few best practices that I can say with confidence and say with personal experience. Uh, so any uh, has has anyone used uh, GCP or Vertex AI? Does does anyone know any other? Traditional, like apart from Chat GPT, do you and uh, know any other? So, so in Google there are like uh, models like Text Bison and Text Bison. Uh, so it is very focused into text summarization and actual Q and A stuff. So you could use those for uh, for your actual text summarization use cases. And like there is other very very famous model called as MedPalm which is only focused on to medical research and it, it has like actual, the data set for it is regarding medicines and all, all things that have been done into medical research. So I tried to get access to that, but it has several uh, medical compliance issues and editage dot, uh, like the actual US, Google US needs to provide uh, authorization for that. Yeah, so this is all about me. I started my career as a hosting product specialist, which is code name for system administrator. And uh, if you guys know Bluehost, Bluehost, I used to manage their email and hosting space for like uh, around 15 months. And with the experience and the, uh, with the insights gained from my system administration experience, I dived into the vast domain that is DevOps. So my journey began in 2019. And right now, I am an AWS community builder, and I do a lot of uh, thought leadership as well. So yeah, uh, besides work, I have I'm passionate about a lot of stuff, and this stuff uh, is mentioned in the slide. Uh, let's let's move on. So main focus is Gen AI and using it for cost optimization. So FinOps is cool. 2023 is officially the era of FinOps and doing stuff, making, uh, reducing costs and actually increasing profits because increasing profits should be revenue driven. So this is just one thing where you can keep cost in control. And AWS has a lot of, uh, lots of opportunities where you can go wrong. And basically this is why cost optimization is very important. And yes, this is whole process is manual. So what if you could find a way which can automate this? Okay, sounds great. So existing, let's understand the whole problem statement in a bit more, uh, more detail. So while everyone talks about cost optimization, I am sure that very few people actually get into the crux of it or try to start from right sizing. Right sizing, reducing, removing, re-architecting. So these are some basic R's that we should keep in mind and we should start from those and then try to evaluate if cost optimization or, or we have tried uh, figuring out all other avenues. And it is not often obvious. So cost optimization anomalies can usually take some time to actually get, uh, get into, uh, become obvious and then so the time taken for spotting an uh, anomaly is kind of high. And this is the real life example. So we had a run rate, had a monthly run rate of 32,000 USD. 
and we brought it down to 26k so this is this is entirely manual approach that is three devops engineers were working all for around a month and we did this so let's let's see if we uh, like what is the solution and how we reduced it further so this solution is completely open source like there is a python notebook you can download that and this is the link to it uh, the main features are mentioned over here so rag uh, rag basically grounds the llm and keeps it the context only for aws cost advisor so all cost optimization csv is ingested into the vertex db uh, like the database and the llm model only answers based on the questions that it has on the csv so other feature is humans take considerably long but llm has this data ingested into it and the time taken for detection is also reduced so this is the basic architecture that our system follows question and answer any chatbot model follows the same thing and the main uh, the main highlight here is the vector database so vector database it is locally hosted like csv sqlite you could use all your faqs ingest them into the vector database and then based on the relevant documents so we uh, actually did a benchmarking of our tool and we found that we got really custom and targeted uh, solutions into where a solution architect can look into that and try to optimize their cost okay so that's it time's up any questions